right. Hi, everybody. We're recording. It is time for the plan with me for <laughs> February 1st, 2021. You will notice <laughs> that there was no plan with me for January 25th. Hold on. I have to yawn. Oh, man. There was no plan with me for January 25th. That is because I had super long days <laughs> on Monday and Tuesday and just did not, I just couldn't record. And so I did my planning by myself and, um, and this is what the week looked like. And then, um, let me do, let me also look at my framing. Am I straight on the page? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I mean in the camera. So this is the week of the 18th. That would have been the last plan with me you saw me put down. And um, you'll see this over here. It says work types. I changed the what I was calling them over here. But I'm using this highlighter on the page here to show me how much I do of these three types of work, which I have broken down to touches and finishes. So touches and finishes is something that I used to call walking around work. So when I was working in an office or in a building, um, <sighs> I feel like I have to yawn again, sorry. Oh my gosh, sorry about that. When I was working in an office or a building or whatever, I would just walk around and just like catch up with everybody, make sure we were all on the same page, just communicate with them, like build those social connections that make work easier to do so that, you know, you can, uh, you can remember what somebody's preferences are or what, et cetera, et cetera. Anyway, I called it walking around work. Um, now I call it touches and finishes because what I end up doing in my life is I um you know I have someone else do the bulk of like a bunch of like copywriting or other stuff like that and then I come in and finish it up um also do a bunch of touches and finishes where it's like I'll check up on people online like I email them or I text them or I check to see what if they make content I check to see what they've made recently um just to so that I know what's going on with their life and I can like keep in touch with that and like be aware of it and then if someone is like, oh, I need such and such, I can be like, oh, I know someone who does that or whatever. That's what I call touches and finishes. Um, it's like putting the finishing touches on something. It's reaching out to someone. It's making connections, etc. This is my favorite type of work ever. Um, as you can see, I don't actually do a lot of it, um, which is one of the things I'm talking about. With my business coach lately, like talking about building the business and like where I want to build it and where I want to build out some stuff. Meetings and sales. So that's when I'm actually talking to someone in a way that is earning me money. So that's coaching with them or monitoring or training or, um, you know, I'm talking to them about working with them. So I'm telling them about my rates. I'm telling them about my previous success. You know, it's a sales meeting. I'm trying to convince them to go with me as a contractor. And then maintenance and tasking. Maintenance and tasking is like when I end up doing um, e you know, email uh, and then also like assigning stuff to people, but then also doing tasks myself. So like I have to pay payroll today. So that would be tasking. I have to, uh, you know, fill out a form. That's tasking. That's my least favorite kind of work. So that's what all of these lines are. Um, this is my week. Obviously I pre-planned two weeks ago. I did want to point out something about these erasable pens that I didn't notice or that I noticed last week because I had a shitload, shitload of changes to my schedule last week was that if I, oh, and here's the tools of my trade. I always sort of show that to y'all. Um, and I should actually show these to you. I think I already did, but just in case I didn't, I want to show you these this Pentel brush sign and then this um, Tombow Fudenosuke. I bought these for myself for my birthday a couple of weeks ago. So I've been putting little like a, here's the Fude 
Um, here, here's the sign, who's the Furunosuke. You know, putting little highlights and working on my lettering at the same time. Um, but yeah, um, I actually, and I've been filling out my day so far. I actually forgot to go to therapy today. I took a yoga class online and it was so fun that I just like felt so good and relaxed that I went and took like a super long shower and then I was like laying in bed like, man, I'm so glad I like don't have anything to do right now. <laughs> and I didn't put my watch on after my shower, my like little Fitbit watch that like tells me what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> so I totally missed therapy. Um, but here, I'm going to do an example. So I'm just going to draw an X right here. And then right here, I'm going to draw something. And I've noticed that if I'm using this pencil board, actually, I'm going to do an experiment. So if I'm using the pencil board, when I erase this, the friction will also cause this to erase. See how it's like mostly gone? And if I like change something a couple of times and then erase it, whatever the fuck was written over here is like gone. But I want to see if it works if I don't use the pencil board. So let's put that. Because using the friction on one side of the page will cause friction on the other side of the page. Yeah, which causes it to get erased. It's actually worse if I don't use the pencil board. So that's one thing I just want to point out with these um, pilot friction on pen is that if you erase something on directly the other side of the page, it can have an effect on the other side. So that's a thing. Anyway, let's get to planning. Let me go to my calendar right now. Um, let me also, I haven't started anything and it's been like, let me check. It's been seven minutes. All right, cool. I'm just fucking around. <laughs> this oh shit sticker, by the way, is from Ivory Paper Plans. And I like it. I wish it was an actual eye. Like, I wish it said shit. I got mad when things don't have um, what I want. Also, you might notice that all of my plan boxes are on one half of the column that they inhabit now. And that they used to start one square in, but now they start at the first square. That's because now that I've been doing my time tracking where I just write what the fuck I did in that time place, um, I realized that I don't need to make the box the center of attention. And that frequently I have things that were also going on while something was going on, like not today, but um, you know, I'll be eating snack or like I'll be having lunch. We had lunch at a party that we, a social distance outdoor, uh, January <laughs> party we had for my husband's grandma, which we all brought portable heaters, which made it way less horrible. And it didn't rain, which was very nice and surprising for a January day in Oregon. Um, but it was cold as fuck. And that was a 45 minute party, <laughs> but we got to wave at Ben's grandma for her birthday. She turned 99, so that was really nice. Um, right. Fucking put shit in your planner, Marina. God damn it. Uh, 3.30. Um, let's see. Um... person has a super unique name so I'll just like write the rest of it later and then that's in there that's in there do, do, do. that that excellent and then me and my therapist reschedule <laughs> she was so understanding I was like I am so sorry I just totally fucking spaced it And then I have another meeting here at 2 p.m. And 
and then that guy, and then this Friday, 4 p.m. Life is, life goes so fast, man. Life comes at you fast. Okay, and then this on two. Oh, it's a habit to put that line starting one box in. Um, but that's not what we're doing anymore. And then family zoom. Great. So that's this week coming up. I've got my Thursday update. I've got my Monday update. I'm doing the plan with me right now. So let's mark that off or let's at least put that means it's in progress. If I have like a task and I just put one half of my X, it means it's in progress. And then when it's done, I go and do the other half of the X. Burr, burr, burr. Now let's go to next week, everyone. Um, wow, Monday's super empty next week. That's actually nice. It makes me feel so, like I have, I can do concentration things. Um, let's see, Tuesday at noon, I have a member meeting for a business association I'm in. And then at 2.30 of a regular meeting. And then book club from 5.30 to 7. I actually have another meeting right here. Oh, I was talking about putting my um, Monday and Thursday updates back in the calendar because uh, it was really hard to do them last week when I was like super busy and I missed them and I ended up doing my Monday updated like super late at night and then my Thursday update was on Friday last week because um, it just was, <laughs> and I was thinking of changing them to actually, like, put them back in the calendar. I don't know if that would have helped last week, though. Like, my week was so packed. Uh, alright, 2.30. That's usually a half an hour call, even though I put an hour on the thing. I'm just going to put it right here. I do feel like I have so much to do. Did I put happy hour on this? Yeah, okay, I did. And I even, this is the other thing with like these half boxes. I even like put a little reminder for myself to get a snack between these two things because like I can now that it doesn't take up the full column. Um, happy hour, right. We usually go till 7. Let's not kid ourselves. Let's be realistic. Do, 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 do. And then this is this.
Oh my god. I just really have been feeling like I have so much to do. This is a hold. And then I'm supposed to do a Thursday update. And then Monday update. And then plan with me. I mean, part of me wants to start filming plan with me is on like Sunday so that I'm not, um, you know, always like doing two videos on Monday because Mondays are starting to get more and more packed with just all the things I have to do in a week and, um, plan for and prep for and everything. But then, um... I don't want to, like, come out to the office on a weekend, you know? So then I'm like, okay, so am I filming Clown with on Friday? Maybe that's appropriate because I do publish them on Friday. So if I film them on, the, film them on Friday and then publish them on Friday, like, that kind of works out, right? So... There's my family Zoom, and that's next week. Oh, I forgot to draw these lines. Right. Get my trusty this thing, and I'm using a Pilot G2. This is like the trusty bullet journal pen. Everyone loves it. It's refillable. It's so beautiful. I think it's refillable. Anyway, I just decided to use this guy today because... I was writing with my fountain pen the other day, and this has never happened to me, but I was writing in um, my journal with my fountain pen, and the paper is like slightly toothier than I'm used to, and I was just like, you know what I really miss? It's my Pilot G2. So I got it out of the drawer, and I'm going to take it home. <laughs> I don't miss it on this shit, on this top. No wonder I stopped using it. Okay, let's go back to the dude, the ceramic roller ball. Oh, wow, okay, super smeary. Yeah, okay, I remember why I stopped using the G2 on the Tom Lee River paper. Um, I sound like a fucking snob, but it's true. Now I'm like, oh God, how, how do I wait? How long do I wait for you to try? <laughs> try your butthole. Ah, uh, what time is it? Okay, we're at 18 minutes. We gotta fucking hurry this shit up. <laughs> but anyway, I'm gonna take the G2, long story short, I'm gonna take the G2 back into the house and use it with my new journal. My friend bought me this really nice journal that I'm so happy with. And it's so pretty and it's so easy to use and it lays flat, it's fun to write in. Um... And I was going to show that, show, show, I was going to show it to you last week when I did my plan with me because it was so cool. And then I just didn't do a plan with me. And now I've written in it. <laughs> so I don't know. Maybe I'll like clip those pages that I've written in together so that none of my secrets get out. So I can show it to you like next week or something. But I love it. Um, how did I celebrate myself today? Myself today. Um, and then how did I move my body? Um, great questions. Oh, and then one more thing. I don't know if I told you guys this. I think I did. If you list, if you watch my like Monday and Thursday updates, I talked about this. But I um got really just um kind of fucked up about what happened at the Capitol. I know this was like several weeks ago. There, I think I did talk about it. Cause now I'm remembering myself. But um, I started cleaning late at night. And some people might be like, man, I wish I had that problem, but I don't wish it on my worst enemy. I was just stress cleaning instead of sleeping my house. 
And then because I was cleaning, I obviously wouldn't sleep. And then I would be super tired. And then because I was super tired, the only thing I like had the brain capacity for was to scroll Twitter. And then I would scroll Twitter and I would see news updates on just really super negative things that were happening. Like none of the like, hey, these guys are actually being prosecuted or like, hey, consequences. There are consequences happening. Like, but all the places where like consequences weren't happening or they were happening, happening like badly. And then people even were like posting old stories of times that like racist assholes got away with crimes on my Twitter. Like, hey, remember this? And I was like, oh, so then I would just get in my head and um, flip out and clean all night again. So I talked to my therapist about it. And basically now this line is I'm not cleaning after midnight. It doesn't and or doing any labor. I'm not doing laundry. I'm not, you know, there's. I'm not doing work work. I'm not doing anything that's like work after midnight. And then 2 a.m. is when I start getting ready for bed. And I've actually been pretty good at it. So um, on Tuesday, um, I yeah, I was getting ready for bed at 2. I was getting ready for bed at 2.30. 2. I went bed, got ready for bed at 3 on Friday, but it was Friday night. You know, this was two. I actually got in bed before two last night because I woke up super early to go um, to the birthday party. And I even had a nap, but still, I was like, no, I'm tired. <laughs> um, But yeah, so let me move my page indicator over here. And um, that's it. That's my day. So thank you for coming to my plan with me. I'll see you next week. Bye.